What's up YouTube? Welcome to the video. I'm going to show you how to rank up fast if you don't have a lot of weapons unlocked and you are still a low level in the game. Today I'm playing on a subscriber's account and he's having troubles ranking up fast. We're trying to get so we can use the firebug shotgun. I don't have it on my account but he has it on his. So we are going to accomplish that in today's video. Got to our warden. We finally picked it up a little bit in this game, guys. But we did unlock some camos and challenges, so we're going to see what happens at the end, see how much XP we get. If we get enough, we'll double it. If you have double XP tokens, that's a great, easy way to rank up his love as well. He's throwing some spidey nades at me. And we just went off towards the second half of that game. 25 and 10, 2,725 score with a 2.5 KD. Let's see what we get for our XP earn. We're trying to get to 47 so we can play with the Firebug. It's one of the Rack 9, the new shotgun variants that has the incinerary shells. So we gained 19,879 XP that game i'm showing i'm showing you the best ways to rank up if you're at a low level you don't have a lot of challenges or camos unlocked then this is what you need to do go for the things that you haven't done don't focus on getting the most kills in the game play a game mode that's going to be the fastest that you can do and you will earn the most xp Friendly advanced UAV. There you go, team. There you go. We now have the Rack 9 Firebug in Infinite Warfare. I got you leveled up, man. I'm glad that you let me get on your account today. Hopefully, I showed you a few tips and tricks to leveling up. If you are grinding to get to a Master Prestige, or if you're just starting out from level 1 and you're trying to get to level 55, so you can prestige one time, follow your challenges, pick a weapon, focus on that weapon, get your camos, what are you closest to on your mission teams? Start different mission teams because as you rank up more, it becomes harder to get to the next level. So start from the beginning on each mission team. Just do a little bit at a time and you will get extra XP than you've been getting per game. Also, if you have Mark II weapons, use Mark II weapons. I was using a Mo Money variant in the first gameplay that you probably saw. I don't know how much of this video I'm going to cut or not cut. But this is going to be my first game using the Firebug, the Incinerary Shells Shotgun for Infinite Warfare. They have this now in Call of Duty World War II, and it is OP. I have seen videos of this weapon, but I have not used it in game. So let's see what happens. It's 9 to 15 right now. I'm going to have to play like a shotgun as best as I can. I'm not the greatest with shotguns, but we're going to try. I don't know how he just blasted me right there. I have no idea. No idea how he blasted me. But we do have some people in here. Oh, so it doesn't really doesn't really like catch him on fire like the good animation it does in World War II. Huh. There's a guy up here.
Yeah, it doesn't have the cool animation like it does in World War II, but it does have the incendiary shells. You can see it as it hits them. They have like a light glow to them. I think it's still a good weapon. The shotgun variant for the Rack 9, the Lance, is I think one of the most popular Rack 9 variants. The Firebug, I mean, you can't, you can't be too upset with the way that it shoots. It's a pretty cool variant, that's for sure. See how I, oh, I hear it now. That's sweet. So it has like a couple hit markers to them. Once you hit them with the fire bug, you can hear it. Um, you can hear the little hits, like the, I don't know, <laughs> what do you call it? Yeah, the hit marker. That's what I'm trying to say. I couldn't speak. But you can hear the little hit markers after you hit them with the incendiary shells. It does inflict more damage just leaving it on them. So that's pretty neat. Just doesn't have the cool animation. But I am definitely liking this weapon. Except I couldn't get anything right there. Thank you again for letting me get on your account. I'm glad that I could rank you up. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. He's got right here. I think we can get him. Oh my gosh, he hit me with the M2187. I don't think that the Rack 9 Firebug is better than the M2187. I think it's a little bit easier to use. Uh, the M2187 is, not the Rack 9. The Rack 9, you have to really get your shots precise, man. Like, I just got a couple of them back there, and it ended up getting me two kills, which is pretty sweet. There we go. I'm not sure how far the damage is. Oh my goodness, I was escaping the fire there. I was escaping the heat. I forgot I had reactive armor on. I could have go ahead. I could have used that. That would have saved me a little bit, but you know. We just go in. I don't know. I think this weapon would be pretty good if you use it a little bit more. If I get better with it and I get a good gameplay, I'll show it to you guys for sure. But we finally got to use the Rack 9 Firebug in Infinite Warfare. If you guys have used this weapon, let me know down in the comment section. If you guys think this is the best shotgun of the game, drop a like on this video. I think the M2187 still is better. I really do. I really do think it's better. But the way that this works is pretty cool. Not gonna lie. The more I'm seeing it in action, the more I'm liking it. They should make the epic variant of this. The incinerary shells where you have more range and damage that would be sweet that would probably be the best shotgun variant in the game you just have to be very accurate with this i feel like i don't know i hit him i think no yep, no little hit markers he's gonna still be over here i'm not i'm just not sure if we want the outside or the inside he uh Oh my gosh, my goodness, 65 to 65, it is a tie game, we are st still in here grinding with this incinerary shell shotgun, I wish it had the animation like it does in World War 2, that'd be sweet, what are you boys doing, should I turn on the reactive armor, Got on reactive armor. We're moving in. Jeez. I think I'm just gonna sit in here. Getting the most kills in here is how you play like a shotgunner, right? The guy back there. Wow, he played us. Holy mo we just got blade. 85 to 71 we are winning this game i'm not doing too much help for the team that's for sure I'm just kind of hanging out oh my goodness this guy with the salvos man if he wasn't using the salvos i'd probably have a little bit more kills he's been dominating with the shotguns i don't know if he's doing good if he's only killing me i have no idea but i know oh my sorry apologize for that sir All I know is he's getting kills. Nobody in here. Enemy UAV. Wonder if they're all incinerary shells. Uh, 
Because World War II, you have like the first clip or something like that's incinerary shells. Oh, I have blind eye on. I don't know why I'm shooting that thing. Oh my. That'd be pretty sweet, huh? Oh wow. <laughs> that was crazy. 17 and 13. 95 to 95. Somehow they're coming back. I hope they don't win this. I'm trying not to let them win. The goal is for us to get the victory. I heard some scooting around over here. I guess it was um, my teammates. Come on, boys. It's 98 to 97. We have to get this W. I'm about to get this win right here. Boom. Got him. We got that W. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Once again, shout out to the man. Let me on his account to show you guys how to rank up and so you could see the first gameplay for me with the Rack 9 Firebug. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, make sure you drop a like. Subscribe if you are brand new. And maybe I can rank up and level up your account on any of the Call of Duties. If you'd like that, let me know down in the comments section. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here and I will talk to you later.